In this video, we're going to look at how to find the surface area of a cone. So to find out the surface area of the cone, you've got to consider two parts. The first part is the curved surface, so the big one around, and also the base, the circle at the bottom. So the curved surface area of a cone, this part, is equal to pi times r, the radius, times the slant height, which is the diagonal length there. Okay, so you do pi times the radius times the slant height. And then you need to add on the base to find the total surface area. So then you get the area of the base, which is pi r squared. Okay, let's do an example. So here we've got a cone, and the cone's got a perpendicular height of eight centimeters. It's got a radius of six centimeters, and it's got a slant height, uh, slant of 10 centimeters. So first of all, let's work out the curved surface area. So that's pi times the radius, which is six, times this, this uh, slant height, the diagonal length here, which is times 10. So that's going to be pi times 60. And on your calculator, do pi times 60. So shift pi times 60 is equal to 188.495592. So that's the curved surface area, and that would be centimeters squared. And the base is the area of the circle at the bottom, so that's going to be pi r squared, so pi times 6 squared. So that's going to be pi times 36. Whenever you work that out, pi times 36, you get that to be equal to 113.097335 centimeters squared. So the total surface area, the total surface area is equal to the sum of those two. So it's 188.495 and so on, plus 113.097 and so on. And whenever you add those two together, you get a total of 301 point five nine two so on centimeters squared and let's run that to one decimal place that's going to be three hundred and one point six centimeters squared and that's the surface area for this code